Welcome everybody for this talk about legal design, the legal creative approach to enhancing legal experience and improving access to justice. The world has changed, moving online, every day moving even more online, and it seems like legal professionals are far behind in a world that no longer exists. In the legal field, users have new expectations about how to be served, and they feel those needs are not being met for three major problems. First, they want cost predictability. Second, they want clarity in the process. And third, they want outcome value and certainty. And because those new needs are not being met, they might turn their back from legal professionals. This is why it's time to change and to turn these challenges into innovative solutions in the digital age using innovative methodologies. My name is Tessa Manuelo, based in Montreal, Canada, founder of Legal Creatives. And today I will share with you the Legal Creatives approach for legal design, how we use it. And I will also conclude with six legal design tips for you to start using in your law firm and your legal tech startup. For legal to remain accessible, the issue of cost need to be thought through. But for users, accessibility is not just about affordability. And that brings a few questions. How, as legal professionals, can we deliver the results consumers expect from us? What kind of processes must be in place at the law firm and this legal tech startup to ease the legal experience? But finally, what type of legal experience can be created and for what cost? Legal design, as I apply it, is a creative problem-solving approach based on users' needs and desires to imagine new legal solutions and to develop them through technology. For us, accessibility is a combination of cost, process, and outcome. And legal design can help you achieve that. We have actually used it for developing the first all-in-one solution for solo lawyers to kickstart and grow their career in the digital age, making legal accessible around those three topics, cost, process, and outcome. And today, I want to share my six legal design tips for you to start using at your law firm and your startup. First, know your clients. Who is your target audience? Discover the needs, but mostly discover the desire. Second, review the data you have collected. Identify those clients' desire, especially the ones that are unmet on the market. Three, reverse engineer. Assess your internal processes against the desire of a client and try to bridge the gap between what you offer and what your clients and target audience really want. Four, imagine a completely new legal experience. Seek for novelty. Stand out from the crowd. Five, develop a user-friendly interface online, which is attractive and geared to your target audience. And finally, but not the least, implement the solution with technology, which is going to be a great tool for you to save time and money. And not just that, but to enhance the client experience and to reduce the access to justice gap. That's it for today. Now let's stay connected. Visit now legalcreatives.com. You have questions and comments? Send me an email at tessa at legalcreatives.com.